Hey, orange one here. So we're at Epicrotea, which we actually just took. Um, we're currently at War of Landia, but I don't know how much I'm going to really be involved in that because we're trying to do the uh, the main quest. So let's see, Astania, she is, should be in here. And if it's anything like the other thing, yeah, we have to meet her at her house through that menu up there. Cool. Okay. It's kind of... Brings you to me. Wait, what? Voice acting? Is that true? What? You may have one piece of the banner, but it's of little Hold on. itself. You'll have to find the other parts. <laughs> but once you can bring together the pieces, you'll have something of tremendous value. That's crazy. The banner of Calradius is part of a legend. There's voice acting now. Oh, but not for everything. <laughs> the voice actor find the missing pieces, it's like no that's too much I can find someone who will take it from your hands before I reveal that information to you um sure I'll tell him that I'm trying to save the emperor good I do not know where the other people when you have okay so we need to just like I suppose like the quest would just end if you told them that you weren't going to do it for that, but whatever. We'll go to this hideout. It's just right up here where we need to go. I might want to let other people join other armies. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to work with us leaving this faction. Um, let's see, you like us the least. But you're gonna get it pretty much guaranteed so we might as well make you a friend of us yeah we'll we'll make you our friend these other guys are not gonna like us very much yep now you're our, our homie though so we made two people that didn't really like us like not really like us that much less and there's only nine dudes in here we have like an army of 900 like for real this is insanity Whatever. Um, we're at peace? Northern Empire. Well, I thought we just took the last city from the Northern Empire, so yeah, you'd expect us to be at peace with them. They're not really gonna be able to do much now to us. What happens to the kings when they're, they're like this? Do they just kind of wander around the land not um, working with them? Um, I'm confused, like, why it seemed to, like, give me the thing, but not, like, give me the option to wait there. Okay, whatever. We'll crush these guys pretty quick. There's honestly not even that many of them. We could, like, probably snipe them. Oh, come on. Come on. Here we go, Hillman. Yeah, it's gonna be just a matter of uh, clearing this out, which should be super easy from what we've seen in the past. Uh, that dude just stood in front of me as I was trying to take my shot. There we go. Oh, right in the neck. I love how you can hit people in the neck now. Like, seriously, it's pretty awesome. Like the headshots, I, I do like those, but having the neck be a valid target makes it so much easier to get some like one hit kills. Does the neck do as many as high of a multiplier as a headshot? I think it doesn't. I think a headshot's times three and neck is times two, but I don't know. Could be wrong. Man, I like I feel like with this game I really, really, really enjoy it. But I am I, I can't wait till like the real mods come out for this game like you know how they said how they want to um, release the uh, modding um, programs and whatnot for this I think they said a year after the beta came out so we got a while to go but I'm so looking forward to uh, like going into like medieval England doing like a Breton Walda with this. Oh, 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 
I just headshot one of my companions. <laughs> oh man, he went flying. That was awesome. Yeah, guys, please don't run on, on in front of me. I think there's one more dude, like way, way, way over there. Oh, we almost got him, actually. Oh, I actually managed to hit him. It, did he... Were we too far away for him to even do anything? I think there's like an error or something there. Hello. My shield's like fully intact, so I'll gladly duel you. And the fact that you don't have that axe that the other dude had is comforting to me. And oh look, <laughs> when he hit me there, he like didn't actually really get through the armor. Cool. Hello brigands. I'll get my piece of the banner here. I honestly don't, because I haven't even really been listening to the main quest because I don't really have any interest in it. <laughs> um, there we go. So, found the final piece, now I need to return to Arzagos. Um, he's still at Marineth. Okay, well we're gonna go there because we're not gonna restore the emp Empire. And the all of the Empire factions have been crushed. Like seriously, there's no more Empire factions left. Um, it's just the Asari. Kuze, Vlandians, and I mean the Sturgeons are kind of in it, but I don't think they're gonna last very long. It's really these big, these three, and we're really winning. And the Kuze I think is in second, and these guys maybe on third. Um, so we want to go to where was it that we needed to go? Marineth, right? Where's Marineth? Marineth is down here. Oh, we're at war. We're gonna have to siege another place down. But, I mean, we actually have um, a good-sized army. You know. I'm actually going to buy all of this. Thank you. And then if we get low on food, we can kill the cows. And I think we might actually need to do that because we're actually pretty low on food right now. Um, I kind of want to go to Marineth and just take the city. Um... Because I kind of don't want to play this game. Uh, we can't take all of it. Uh, well, let's say let's say that we take pretty much all of it, but then I give you some of the grain back. How about that? Yeah. No. Okay, I'll give you a lot of the grain back. Okay, we're cool now. Um. And I could easily take one of these castles. The unfortunate thing is by going all the way to that city. Is that we're gonna be passing a lot of places that we could take that we probably should be putting pressure on. You know what I mean? But if we go to Marineth and, and take Marineth, that's good for me, so. The Sari Empire, you're you're uh, going to greatly help me in my personal endeavor to uh, <laughs> start my own faction. You just don't know it yet. Uh, yeah, you guys really don't like me. You're kind of my homeboy, so... Guess what? I think what's happened is that the Asari, they've taken a ton of land, and now all these people have joined their faction, and they're giving land out to the people that have joined pretty recently. Oh look, we're at 250 charm! Extra plus one... what? I'm confused by that. Charm extra plus one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe that gives me an extra... I, I really don't know what that... I think that's just a placeholder. I just got the placeholder charm skill. Weird. Okay, yeah, we'll just keep on moving. How many days of food do I have now? 21 days of food. Blue can... Yeah, you're... You don't want to... You don't want anything to do with this, bud. Uh... Yeah, let's go over to Marineth. We're gonna just keep on marching our merry way. Um, might see about stopping off here and guess getting a little bit more food. Oh, actually, our... Do we have another thing that just got leveled up? Yes, we do. 
Um, parties and armies you lead move faster. I think that's objectively the better choice there. Uh, because, I mean, if you can be moving a little bit faster, and if I can get, like, a big old army and get smooth fast, then I am a happy camper. Let's just get that all the way up. And I'm realizing we probably need more um, horses is probably what's really limiting me right now. But we do have just about uh, oh, a little too much grain there. Just about as much as we can carry. Actually, you know what? I, I lied. We could get rid of like all of this stuff and then just get a ton of grain. Replace that with as much as it will let me. That is not. Yeah. Yeah, sure. I don't. I really don't care. You can take all those weapons. Do with them what you want. We're gonna go to Marinef. <laughs> Oh man, with an army this size, there's not really much that they can do. Oh look, we already have starving people in our army. Um, I really don't care. Yeah, we're not gonna just get in there. There's no way sneaking in with an army like what we've got here. We do have a 2 to 1 ratio. I think we'll do kind of like what we did last time. We'll get the rams and siege towers up and then we'll work on some siege equipment that seemed to work out pretty well i don't think we're gonna have too many issues though because oh look never mind we're at peace cool well i guess we don't have to do that siege then you guys probably haven't like value got like a value on food or anything that's like crazy okay let's see what this means to take our own faction <laughs> I can yeah I want to create my own kingdom independent significant renown okay yeah Rule settlement that's not imperial. How do you rule a settlement without being part of a kingdom? Okay. So I think what we need to do is tell Unquid that we're done with the Sorry, Which has got to be kind of crazy. Um, where is he at? If I go to... Uh, kingdoms. Sorry. Unquid. Um, where are you at? Last seen near back. Okay, where's that at? That's like, I'm pretty sure... Yeah, it's Koya, so that's back in our, our home territory. Okay. Well, we'll go all the way down there. I don't know how long this is going to take, because we do have like a super mega big army. Um, Which is kind of leveling up our skills right now. So I'm not sure if I want to disband it. Like, I think it levels up your stewardship, right? Or leadership, yeah. So we're getting... Um, wow, quite a bit of a boost there, actually. Yeah, those skills are not great, but whatever. Like I said, we're just going to make our way to the king. And I wonder if when we leave, if we get to keep our settlements, I, he's probably going to take them as well, I'd imagine. Because that's what they did in the, the old one. Oh, look at that. They got their little fields there. That's kind of cool. Is that the grain? Yeah, that looks like that's what the grain does. Man, look at how much money we make in a day. 13k. Those fiefs are just making us a crazy amount of money. I'm pretty sure if we have more than one and a half million gold, that we'll be able to um, make our own faction. I could be wrong, but I mean, we are richer than like kings from the other uh, factions. Yeah, these, uh, all, all the other factions made peace with us because we basically have been expanding so quick. I'm pretty sure they've all recognized that uh, we're the more powerful force now, and they don't really want to fight us. Interesting thing will be to see 
how unquib how his warmongering go goes um, against the others. Now I'm thinking I'm gonna go deep in Asari territory and try and take over the old territory. Wait, what did I? Huh? I guess I just got some experience. I, I don't know if that was the random notables perk going off. I'm pretty sure that's what it was, but I don't really know. Um, so if I go back, uh, I wanted to find you. Where are you at? He was last seen near back. Okay, so we're still, still going to that area. He could be popping up any second. I might have missed him, actually. I wasn't looking very closely. He could have just gone right past me. Hopefully not, though. Man, the cohesion in this army goes down pretty quick. Wait, what? What's with my influence? I thought I was getting like plus like 70 or something like that. I think we're going to have to get rid of um, the mega army. I'm pretty sure that's what's costing us so much. Uh, so let's see if I go back here. He was last seen near Bach still. Not not getting any uh, any news on him being around here. Yeah, he's not in, in this town. Um, can I recruit troops? No, I cannot. Okay. Let's do a little trade while we're here, right? We might as well do a little trade while we're looking for the king. Oh look, I can actually sell this stuff at a pretty nice profit here. Sure. Why not? Right? And I think I'm actually going to disband our our, bi our big old mega army here. Yeah, it's just going to be easier to disband and then tell my companions to stay with me, I think. Yeah. There we go. Perfect. And we're a happy family. Uh, do I have another companion that's uh, around here, maybe? I don't know. No, I think... Yeah, let's go ahead and um, go to our clan. Create new party. Uh, I know you're in my party, so I'm going to create that. And guess what? You're going to get all these guys. Cool. And then we'll have you join up with us, right? Yeah, perfect. Okay, so you should join back up with us and we'll have our 200-something troops again. And then I just need to find Unquib, wherever he's gone off to. I mean, he was last spotted here, but I know he's not here. You know? Hmm. Yeah, I think we just go questing. Uh, let's go back here and we'll get some food. It looks like we're sharing food with people. So we're probably going to want some more. Yeah. Sounds good to me. I mean, if he hasn't gone to Koyaz, I wonder if he went this way or something. Sometimes I think they they do that. He might also just be like dropping off troops at some of the various places back here. Just making them a little bit more reinforced okay come on uncle where are you hamish where's that oh look i was going in the right direction that's that's nice that's nice that i uh i wasn't going in the opposite direction of where i needed to be going yeah it looks like there's a lot of people that have been recruited recently um i'm gonna buy all the grain and sure i'll buy all the silver as well I'm just trying to get out of this faction, so let's see if we can get to that lord. Another kid. How many kids do we even have now? Like, honestly. I think we've got like 10 kids. If I have over 10 kids, I think we can probably have our wife not hang out in our party. Oh my god, look at that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, well, she'll stay in the party then. We did say ten. <laughs> oh, man. Let's, let's keep on going. 
If I need to, I'll take a city from the. Sorry. <laughs> Probably not the smartest move. Um. Okay, the king's not here. Is he? If I go to N, to tell me. Kedar, where's that now? I'm just like jumping around, following people. Yeah, you don't need to keep these all collected anymore. Sure. We'll go after the king there. I mean, he'll have cleared out all the recruits, so I might as well just go straight to the village. You know? Eh, nah, I'm gonna, I'll stop at Nal, Nalan. I think I have, like, a friendly lord here. Nah, not friendly enough. Oh, look, they're... That's cool, they're, like, on foot themselves. I hadn't realized that... Yeah, I, I mean, I knew that the armies, you could kind of see the lords like that. Medini... Where's Medini? There's the Medini castle right there. Medini's over there. And I could deal with that with for you, but I might just send a companion out to go do it if I've got someone with me. Oh no, you don't even want to talk to me. Oh, That's a shame. Um, what about... Oh, nope. Uh, now he's near the castle. Okay, so we're getting closer, I think. We're getting a lot closer. If I defeat that desert, those desert bandits, they might like me more around here. Is the king in here? No, he is not. God, I feel like we've been chasing him forever now. Abdig okay, well, where's that? Oh, I'm a, I'm going there. He was around here recently. Now, this is a bit. Um, I have to pick a direction as to what which direction I think he's gone, and I'm not sure. I'm gonna say that he went over here, because I think he's been going that way. Yeah, Kasari. Yep, I'm getting closer. There he is. There he is. What if we, like, attack him? <laughs> How many people does he have? We actually have more troops than him. I bet that, um... Yeah, we've got, like, 40-something recruits. Yeah, I'm not gonna attack him. That's just too close, numbers-wise. <laughs> That'd be so funny if we, like, just, like, killed him. Like, executed him. <laughs> no, we're not gonna do that. We'll just be like, hey, um, I mean, you know how rich I am. <laughs> I'm gonna start my own country. <laughs> I'm actually gonna take it all. I think we're gonna need the food if we really are going to war. Um... I present you... Yeah, no, I don't want to do that. Uh, I wish to be released from my oath. Yes. It's something I must do. Yeah, so we just lost all of that. So they're actually... Um, interesting. Oh! You need to be a part of a kingdom to have, uh... Oh, I didn't realize that. To have an army. Really? That's silly. Okay, well, we're gonna have to be smart about this then. I can't have them in my armies. Hmm. Okay, well, everyone hates me now for leaving the, uh, that main faction. <laughs> Um, hmm. Well, I'm gonna have to think about what I'm gonna do. Um, I mean, probably the smart thing is to build relation with hideouts and then try and find um, a place that's a little bit less well defended and attack it. 
I, I, I don't know actually, honestly, how we're going to do it if we can't form our own army. That's, that's annoying. Like seriously, super annoying. Um, but I think I'll just gather my forces and then, oh, they actually are following me. It looks like. Sure. We'll do some questing. Um, just so that you guys will will give me more recruits mostly because I think I need to just get my my numbers up um yeah we'll just do a quick little quest or two I bet that's where they've gone watch it no molly uh where is that okay okay I can do that oh um hold on just really quick if they have horses, yeah, I'll take actually all those horses. Thank you. Yeah, we have workshops, so we should be generating still some income, but it's a lot less than our 13,000 was. You can see that, right? I mean, our parties are... Yeah, they're not following us. That is a shame. Well, yeah, I better not hope that they're going to join me if I try and siege a place down. Hmm, I may have really shot myself on the foot here, leaving our faction. Yeah, it, it appears that we've done a grave mistake. <laughs> Though it should work out. I, I do think it will work out. It's just going to be a little rough patch here, trying to find um, someone who's on the receiving end of a war and try and take something from them. Though, granted, all the factions are a lot bigger and more powerful now, so that might be kind of difficult to do. Do I not have any companions with me? I don't. Okay, well, hopefully I don't have to kill you, buddy. Oh, wait, no, what? I just let them go. I just failed that quest. Whoops. Huh. <laughs> Uh, well, we just got an increased relationship with... Oh, man, that was that was a misclick. That was bad. I don't think those Sari are going to be losing anytime soon. I think it's going to be the Sturgeons. So if I can find, like, a Sturgeon castle somewhere... There's, like, no Sturgeon castles, really. It looks like they just have cities. Well, that kind of makes sense. They are being crushed. Oh, no, there's uh, Thorios Castle right there. Alright, that's where I'm going to be aiming for, is Thorios Castle. That's the, the mission in life. And we're probably going to need to train up our troops a fair amount, seeing how we can't get any recruits, you know? Yeah, all these people seem to not like me. I need to go to, like, a former place of mine, get some recruits that way or something. Yeah, it seems like nobody will join my party. I mean, I have a decent relation with you. Yeah. By not being part of the faction, nobody's willing to let me uh, recruit from there. I guess that means we're going to have to resort to uh, being a bandit a little bit to get recruits. Um, I'm not sieging any place anytime soon. Oh look, this guy, he's my homie. Kuka. Sure, I'll find your daughter. This one I hope I don't mess up because you actually um are my friend by the looks of it. Um so you wanna go send us over here, cool. I don't think that that's actually uh it is. Okay. Gotta go all the way over there, I guess. That's annoying. We'll do it, though. You gotta maintain the relations that you can. Okay, and what is that little... Yeah, I don't know if this village, like, what it produces, but there was, like, something off to the side there where it was like, what is that? That site... Yeah, that's, like, the people of this place. The people with like the special titles, you know. 
I think, yeah, Spice Vendor. Oh, the Spice Vendor. That's the, um, that's a really good companion. So, uh, I don't think that this generates companions, does it? That'd be super cool if you could later on be like, hey, join me. Like, you know, like the people from this quest. Oh man, that would be epic. That'd be like so epic. Um, let's see. Are you them? <laughs> Boss. Uh, let's see if I can convince you. I've actually got a decent chance, actually. Nope, never mind. Okay, this is basically not going to work out then. Uh, definitely not going to work out. <laughs> oh, man. I tried. But it looks like we're going to have to kill your boyfriend. Oh, man. I was totally right. <laughs> yeah, you're coming with me. I gave the choice, man. That was all on him. Okay, please, game, don't crash. Oh, man, I haven't saved in, like, forever. Please tell me this isn't crashing. I'm losing audio. Or no. I still got a little chirp. Um, yeah, it crashed. God dang it. <laughs> All right, well, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One. I'll see where it last did a quick save. <laughs>